your book was a, a, had an enormous impact at the time, and I read it at the time. And uh, I, I, I'm reluctant to summarize your thesis with you right here. So, I mean, briefly, uh, can you encapsulate for readers who, or listeners who might not have read it uh, sure. the theme of the book? Sure. Well, uh, as you as you mentioned, we're using psychiatric drugs more and more in this country, and if these drugs are as helpful as we as we think they may be we would hopefully see the burden of mental illness going down in our society. And instead, the exact opposite is happening. So since 1987, the number of people on disability due to mental illness in our society has, has now more than quadrupled. So, of course, then you ask why. And then when you go and look at what science is telling us about that, it tells us this. A, the drugs may have a benefit over the short term, I'm talking about antidepressants or even antipsychotics or, say, stimulants for um, ADHD. But over the long term, study after study has found, in fact, that they increase the likelihood of disability. They increase the likelihood that someone will become chronically ill. And, and you see this time and time again. So what you really see in the scientific literature is, is a, real, a real worry, in fact, that even as these drugs may be helpful to some, and even that they, they can be helpful over the short term, over the long term, they increase the likelihood that a person will have a worse outcome. And, and that finding just doesn't get communicated to the public. 